Do you like the taste of honey? Well, let me tell you something. Have you ever tried honeycomb honey? Now on this channel, we have tried the tahini bar, the marshmallow, crunchmallow bites, and the raw cookie dough. And now, for a long time, I've been wanting to do this. I have been wanting to try raw honey comb. Now, you can find this raw honey comb at your local grocery store or food market. Um, I got this from uh, eBay, but sometimes you can't trust eBay. But, I mean, um, now there's a lot of people doing these taste tests of raw honeycomb and I've always wanted to do it and this taste test what I'm about to do. Now a lot of people are eating the raw honeycomb because it has a lot of health benefits or eating the honey or just eating it out of the raw honeycomb. There's not a lot of benefits to the honeycomb itself. The honeycomb has a little bit of vitamin A but it's mostly just beeswax. The honey found in the raw honeycomb is actually really nutritious in its full raw form. Once you extract honey from the honeycomb, when you break the cell, when the honey is extracted from the air, honey starts to pull moisture out of the air and you end up with 12 to 10% of the water in the honey you would normally purchase. Now this is a very popular honeycomb brand that is a lot of people really like to eat and it is called the savannah bee company which you already seen in the intro but um yeah let's pop this thing open let's see what it looks like let's see what it feels like let's see what it tastes like well, let's taste test it and let's see if it is good and i am so excited to taste it now on the box you can have it with cheese and fresh bread with goat cheese, hot biscuit, you know, warm toast. This is about six ounces and it was about $15. As you guys can see here, it's really, really glistening, golden. Now on the box, you can peel here. Um, let's open this thing. Now this is entirely edible and you can eat the whole thing if you want. I mean, I saw a YouTuber, ASMR person named Sass ASMR, and she was eating the whole thing. It's like crazy how she can eat that much sugar in the, in the honey. So, and the whole honeycomb, you know, it's crazy. Now we're gonna open this thing up. There we go. As um, you see here, a little part of the honey beeswax came off and it looks even better when opened. Oh my, oh my goodness. So let's just, you know, pop this right here. Okay, now I, um, I popped it out. Um, as you can see, I'm using this plastic um, sort of cutter here, or knife as you can think of it. But anyways, what I'm trying to say is that if you can't really, when you use steel or any type of metal to cut honey, it re it releases um, a t type of taste that's like a metally type of taste. And like you have to usually cut it with, um, with wood or plastic. Let's cut this thing. This is so tough. Oh man, look at that. That glory of food. <laughs> oh man. That honeycomb looks so tasty. I can literally smell it. I can literally smell the glory, guys. It's so golden. Honey. Comb. And as you can see, the honey just comes straight out of the, of the honeycomb. Now let's eat this thing. Just glistening. The wax has no flavor. Wax consistently, see? 
the honey though is just bursting. I mean, it's so crazy. This, I'm chewing the wax, but overall, it's amazing. It's it's one of the most exotic honeys I've ever tasted. Mmm. So as you guys see here, I got regular honey from the tube that you usually find in your store and it's a lot different. It's thicker. Tastes a lot different and this one is a lot lighter it's not it's not darker and a bit thinner but um tastes really different anyways beeswax is made by the bee eating honey now bees have to eat eight pounds of honey they get one pound of beeswax now after the when the bees eat the honey they form a little wax sheet on their abdomen that wax sheet that flakes off and then the bees chew it up and form it into the honeycomb okay guys thank you for watching if you enjoyed it please give this video a like share it with everybody you know and i'll see you guys in the next video bye